But listen, we, we, we talked about it throughout this game, right? They, they didn't play well. If they won this game, it would have been an absolute steal. And, you know, they just they didn't play consistent enough. They didn't play smart enough. I thought at times they didn't play hard enough. Um, and then once you get into the latter stages of the third period and you get into overtime when, when you got 5D, it, it's, it's going to catch up to you. And unfortunately, that happened. Unfortunately, the streak is over. The streak is over for Bruins, but more importantly, the streak for us, Nick. Fan cred. We took an L. We took an L. We did. Four and one now, Keith. You can't go undefeated. It's just we it do wasn't have possible. A, no, we do have an eight to one goal differential still, though. So I feel good about that. That's not bad. That's not bad. Point. All right, everybody. This sucked ass. Yeah. Um, hopefully, game three, we see the right Bruins. Hopefully, we see the Bruins with some legs. Hopefully, we see the Bruins have a top line and Marshy not stink. Uh, but that's it. 3-2, St. Louis wins in overtime. Stanley Cup final now tied one game apiece. Uh, game three coming up this weekend. Hopefully the bees can get it done. Uh, pay attention to Twitter, of course, at Keith 21 at Nick C radio and at fan cred. We'll keep you, uh, we'll keep you up to date as to what the plans are. As far as what we do going forward, we'll obviously have more games, but there it is. Three, two St. Louis. Uh, they end up winning game two at the garden. Now it's up to the bees to go on the road to get the job done for Keith. I'm cattles. Unfortunately, I don't need to see St. Louis and, NBC Sports no, Network. We're good. We're good. Get them off. Get up. You know what? It's See your you remote. Get them off my screen. You got to go. See, you. See a bunch of fucking St. Louis people jumping up and down, giving high fives. No thanks. All right. That'll do it. <laughs>